Good old Facebook. Allowing a hacker to take over my page, change the name with a swear word in it, and then Facebook refuses me to change the name back. Many people know on Facebook that I got hacked back in January, and the hackers came in there and changed my name to JS Video News and More. Now, Facebook was able to get the page back to me. I have control back. However, they now will not allow me to change my name. That's my name, JS. When I try to change it, your page name can't be changed. So I've been hacked. They changed my name to JS, and now I cannot change my name to what it should be. I've been on Facebook for a long time, 2012. I mean, come on, you'd think that after so many years having the same username that they would give me some sort of acknowledgement. You know, it's hard to believe that after having this Facebook page for so long that I'm just going to have to abandon it, unpublish it, and start over. You know, I really I really don't know what to say at this point. Um, I have no more faith in Facebook since they have no faith in me. Have you ever tried to make a page on Facebook with a swear word in it? You can't do it. Facebook won't allow it. If I tried to make a page right now with the word ass in it, Facebook would not allow it. So why is it that this hacker was allowed to change my name to a way that it would harass and bully me? And then Facebook takes no action to help me get my page back to the original way it was. I mean, I just don't understand. I mean... This page is even monetized. I make money on Facebook. Facebook sends me money every single month for my videos. And yet they won't help me change the name of my page back. I don't know what to do. I can't email them. I can't call them. There's nobody to talk to. It's just an invisible company with nobody in charge. It's a great big bully against people. I mean, Facebook, come on. You know, I, I understand Facebook is a private company. They can do exactly what they want. But those of us that provide you content and videos and views and advertisement, you should be helping me. I shouldn't be having to jump through hurdles to get you to see. I mean, I don't know what else to do other than say Facebook is a bully. They are bullying me right now with this page. They're teasing me with my last name that for years I've had to deal with. And now I have a major corporation using my last name to bully me with. So now if you go to any of my videos on YouTube, you will be directed back to this Facebook page, which I've made called Jason Aslan's Adventures. You know, really, it's the only choice I have. I had to create a new page in order to advertise my YouTube videos which is the main reason I got on Facebook in the first place. Anyway, I guess it's just a new chapter in my life, a new way to uh, get my views seen. I mean, for years I did have a quote-unquote news page on Facebook, and I've decided to get out of that field. I've decided to, uh, to start creating more adventurous videos of historic places, of... Uh, places the everyday person may not be able to see or even go to. I want to share my experiences and my adventures across Upper Michigan, Northern Wisconsin, or wherever I go. It just sucks, first of all, being hacked, then having Facebook be the bully against me after the fact, and now having to recreate a whole new page and basically start from scratch. But... What can I say? I, I mean, if you're on YouTube right now and you do have a Facebook account, go down below and uh, click that link and uh, go join my new Facebook page. Otherwise, make sure you hit that like button, hit that share button, hit that subscribe button. If you're not a subscriber, I don't know why you're watching this and you're not. And make a comment below about uh, any experiences you've had 
on Facebook where you've thought they allow that you know what I'm talking about and have a great day everybody no matter where you are in the world and uh, man I think I need a haircut next shave haircut I'm starting to look like crap aren't I